With more bicycle riders on the road today, safety and space are becoming a concern. Sharing city streets with cars and buses can be difficult and dangerous. Amy Compton is always looking for a safe way to commute on the streets. Right now as a biker, you know, I'll, I'll shift. If I feel unsafe on the road, I'll shift onto the sidewalk for a bit. And then if I start to see the sidewalk is getting a little dangerous, I'll shift right back onto the road. Cleveland City Council held a joint committee hearing today to develop a strategy for complete and green streets, streets of the future. What this legislation does is it sets a guide that every time the city fixes a road, they're also going to fix these other things that are going to make it easier for people to bicycle, people to walk, people to jog, people to use their strollers, or for people in wheelchairs. This program is, is, is a citywide program. This is just not for downtown streets. This will happen and affect every single neighborhood in the city of Cleveland. It's the way we redesign our roads and look at our roads and rebuild new roads. Euclid Avenue, which just got a complete makeover, is still a puzzle to be solved by both motorists as well as people on bikes. So says Derek Brown. The whole street as Euclid is kind of a little bit confusing. Cause like people that come out of town, they like the bus lanes is a little bit confusing on Euclid. The new legislation should address most of these concerns and make life easier and safer. In Cleveland, Jim Lentz, News Channel 5.